artists are in tune with their innermost thoughts and visions and are less likely to be influenced by subliminal messages. That is what makes it a greater challenge for me. I want to see today what you have in your mind. This is the reason I ask a group of artists. Your imagination is supposed to be brilliant. I will not tell you too much what to do. It's supposed to be a free choice. You're supposed to do what you want. Be very open-minded, creative. Take everything out on the canvas. The moment that you start to draw, don't look at each other. I don't want you to influence by others. You too. I prepare a canvas for you in another room. There is colors and brushes and everything. And you are going to draw there by yourself. You are definitely not going to be influenced by the group. Before you go, look at this number. Try to remember it. When you will come back, I will ask you the number. Please, go. Thank you. Ready? Mm-hmm. Let's go. Hey everybody, thank you so much. You can uh, stop for a moment. Still concentrate on your drawing and look at it all the time. I ask each one of you to draw something from your imagination. Use your creativity. Use your inspiration. Do not influence by others. This is the moment I want you to look at each other so you can go around and look what you did. Remember, everybody could draw something different. What did you draw? A fish. A fish. You can look at the other drawing. Oh, yes. This, this is everywhere. <laughs> fish everywhere. It's pretty amazing. Pretty amazing. We all drew fish. Fish. He was telling us to just draw what we wanted. I'm like, what the hell are we going to paint? I don't know what to say. He said, think about the composition. And as soon as he said that, I had one in my mind. So maybe he put it there. I'm scared of him. <laughs> I was in my own zone. I, I thought I was just ready to paint a f- Amazing. Pretty freaky. It was weird. Nifty. I was disappointed that everyone did do a fish. <laughs> I wonder how that happened, how it could be possible. I guess I'm just preoccupied thinking about that. Yeah, there was definitely some subliminal communication. I didn't really want to draw a fish, and it's probably the first time I ever have. Did he do that? He kind of... Uh, influenced us to basically just be really spontaneous, and the end result did take me by surprise. <laughs> He looks like a specialist of some sort. It was amazing. I want to know how he did it. Is he going to tell us? Amazing job with the fish that you draw. One hour ago, before you, you came here, I did my art. This is my art. Do you remember that this drawing was here from the moment you start to draw? Mm-hmm. Do you remember the number? Yeah. What is the number? 4511918. 4511918 can be... Big fish. That is so funny. <laughs> I knew that was a big fish all the whole time. Oh, did not see that. <laughs> not at all.